All right, time for Cyclops Snake to bust out of this prison. Oh, we got to call that that number. What was it? One four four seven five. That is correct. I'm impressed that you remembered that. Uh, I have to, two. Just to manually. Here we go. Two. Four. Four. Seven. Five. Oh. Okay. That would do it. Imagine if you didn't do that. Well, that, that's what I was just gonna say. Like, what, what, what happens if you didn't? Cause like that wasn't up for that long. Like, what happens if you didn't do that? Yeah. Did you manage to escape? Yeah. With skill. I'm out. Be careful. In your present state, you're practically naked. Well, you don't Jim have a single naked. weapon, and you'll never survive in a battle. Take some time and pull yourself together. Okay. Eva says she's recovered your equipment. So rendezvous with her as soon Why as possible he in touch to get your her? gear back. Well, I guess she contacted them as an agent in the first Use place. The it just seems route weird because that hasn't really happened up until now. Go down mm. into the sewers through the manhole in the northwest section of Groznygrad. Got it. Start out by exiting the holding cells and heading northwest. Yes, because I have a compass. Yep. Do you have, like, a cork with a needle in it on some water? I think that works as a compass sometimes. I got a camera. Great. Send nudes. I mean, he you said you're basically naked. Uh, take his ammo? He's trying to grab it. Yeah, that didn't work somehow. I mean, if you shake him, do you get his gun? No, you don't get any gun. You shake him. How do you, how do you not? You don't get any guns. But that doesn't dudes. make any sense! You cannot take dudes' guns. Sometimes you shake them and you get, like, random rations or some bullshit. But that doesn't make any sense! Um, That's not how anything works. I'm gonna oh, shit. Oh, there's this guy. Luckily you have the busted rolling move. No one can defeat your rolling shield. Apparently I can't grab dudes. I think you can only grab dudes when you have a knife. Could be wrong about that, but that's sort of the impression I get from everything we've experienced thus far. Yeah, a wooga. A wooga! Everything's fine. Those Russians sure know how to make a danger alarm. They do. <laughs> so dumb. It's like I'm being shot at, but my alert is other. I can get they had a clear line of sight on you, if I'm being honest. Oh, there's this guy. That's gonna be a problem. You had trouble with these guys when you had. Mm. I can't roll in with them. I don't think you can. Just steal a truck. Am I going the right way? I don't know. I don't have a compass. Neither do I. I'm legitimately not sure how you're supposed to know what way to be going. I'm inclined to think you're probably going the right way since there's a lot of guards. No, I'm not sure how you're supposed to deal with the guards if you're not just like. Doing this nonsense? It's going well. Northwest is right, isn't it? I think that was the direction you're supposed to be going. Uh, Why does it sound anew every time you go into a new area? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Uh, I don't I don't. Oh, there's a guy. Watch out for him. We got a camera. Maybe you can take uh, pictures of Metal Gear Ray. I don't know, I feel like I feel like this game strives to present you with really convoluted problems and then like prevents you from using like straightforward solutions to anything. I don't know, I don't like I mean I if you're legitimately asking me, I have, I have no additional information about Like he showed us, but like I don't I was fucking paying attention. I couldn't figure that shit out. You're kind of close to that, aren't you? It seems close when I came in. I mean, this is where I came into this area. No, I mean, like, I, I remember that room with her, with that spotlight there as being an area you yeah, came no, through. I, but I've got to go somewhere new that I've never been before. Luckily, they're shooting at you with blanks, so, you know, it doesn't do that much damage. Got that rat though, so you know, all is well. Oh, yeah! 
Hey, your stamina's are going on low. You want, you want some rat? No, not yet. You know, we'll, we'll How about some Arbat? Ooh, Arbat sounds good. Cool. Really go for a spot of Arbat right now. This is promising. This does look promising. It's cool the way out. That seems like it is. Do you need to be undetected? Is that a thing that can happen? No, that's You got a grenade in smoke? Oh god. I mean, I'm just gonna get killed. Like, this looks like a manhole. Apparently this is the way. This is, this is also something that's a, a personal peeve of mine that this game keeps doing. Where, like... Like, they keep having Eva, like, give you a long series of instructions that are all really important and unintuitive, all in one rapid-fire succession. Yeah, right. And they, then just, like, tell you to deal with it. They spend, like, 20 minutes talking bullshit that's, like, completely irrelevant. Yeah, and then there's, like, two lines of dialogue that are essential, and she delivers them as quickly as possible and then immediately fucks up. Can you call her? Is that a thing you can do? Just be like, Eva, I wasn't paying attention before. Where the fuck do I go? I think I can call me too. Snake, so. you're really gonna feel the cold with no clothes on. Great. The major's right. You'll burn I no longer have a feeling in my balls, Major. They've naked. been grabbed you too many times. Just tell me how to get out of here. Seriously, that's what you're telling me? Try calling her. Eva? Yeah. She's just gonna be like, where are you? Or did she want to respond? I don't know, try it anyway. Yeah. Fucking. Well, no response, you! Is there a map? There is a map. How is there a map? How is this a thing? What the fuck? What? Fuck this. My destination is there, so I need to go do that opening there, and then left, and then straight, and then into that corner over there. What does upward R1 suggest? Upward R1? Yeah, I think it was a command on the map, as if you press R1 and upward happens? I don't really know what that is meant to suggest to you. What? How could you have seen me? How does your naked camo not blend in with the nature of being outside? Yeah, right? That bullshit. doesn't make any sense. Bullshit. I call bullshit on this shit, Master. Right there with you, man. I really am. Where do I go next? You get to drive to Shagahat at some point? I think so. Man, this thing's getting worse all the time. There it is. Oh. Ah, I got you so good! Surprised that it, like, renders someone on the other side of that door. Yeah, and now he's just gone. He opened the door so hard you made him cease to exist. Yeah, that was clearly going the right way. What's interesting is, like, I don't have oh. any, like, means of curing myself. Oh, yeah. But, like, it still doesn't register bullets. I think I'm going in here. Yeah, this this, this area over here something. I'm pretty sure this, this is the- we were in this area before, remember? Before when? Recently before or way before? Oh, yeah, last time we were here. There it is. Okay. Looks remarkably similar to the other one. Is the other one the way we came in? I don't remember. I did it! Nobody saw me. <laughs> That's some really liberal use of air quotes. <laughs> I'm not using air quotes, what do you mean? You're using air quotes whether you like it or not. <laughs> Snake. You're already in the sewers? <laughs> yes, can't you tell by all the very, sirens? Very liberal use of air quotes with I'm already in, in the sewers. The door at the north end is open, right? Uh, Snake? Let me guess. There's a problem. Yeah. Yes. Um, what is it this time? I at least I'm the pregnant. <laughs> what? I'm sorry, I'm pregnant. Oh, much. never mind. How could he have figured out that I escaped? <laughs> How could he have known? my luck. But once I'm out of the just my luck. After walking directly past every guard in the facility, they figured out I was here. I really am the unluckiest spy. You've got to be kidding me. I'm serious. And that means the escape route I laid out is... is sealed off, too. Right. And they just sent a unit out looking for you. Down I'll be here. fine. Uh-huh. They'll be there any minute now. You've got to get out quick. But isn't the exit sealed off? You should be yeah. able to get out by heading straight north. Book it, Snake. If they find you, you're dead. They, wait, what? What do you mean you should be able to get out by going straight north? Is that just some, like, weird science trick? The north of everything is not a solid object? Like, what? I don't understand. You got a leaf med. Oh, David, which way is north? I don't know. 
We can keep asking these questions. Which way is north? Just get a cork and put a needle in it and put it in some water. I think that works. I don't remember why, but I think that's supposed to act as a compass. Maybe we need to do something to the needle first. Look, it's a frog. Fork it. <sighs> why do you- Oh, no. There's actually a very good reason oh. for you to have an empty revolver. Never mind. When I- when I- when I fork, it eats. Oh, it eats right away. Yeah. That's weird. Isn't that awesome? I mean, it's cool, but it's also weird. Okay, which way is north? Am I going north? Great. No, neither seems to be north, assuming that it is naturally oriented with north as up. I mean, there seems to be no other way to go, so I could be like, just go this way. Eat that rat. <sighs> crap battle, crap battle. <laughs> crap battle, crap battle. I gotta find that and send that to you. Oh, I looked it up. Did you enjoy it? I did. It's. I, I feel like if you were to watch it again, it probably wouldn't hold up as well as you think. But I still enjoyed it. No, I'm sure it wouldn't <laughs> at all. It just. It like doesn't make any sense. No. It's like drawing on some like really weird specific reaction that guy had, and he made a cartoon about it. Yep. <laughs> but I. I, I do. All I remember is being stoned with my brother and seeing it, and and thinking it was the funniest goddamn thing we'd ever seen That's in our a, lives. That sounds about oh right. man, I gotta get that. Whatever that is. Looks like some wet noodles, maybe. Rat irons. I am so good. Oh, no, climb the. Like the the water on the camera makes sense when it's like first person coming out of the water, but then when when it like switches back to third person, it's still wet. It's like why? <laughs> why? Can you use the fork on the dog and just eat the dog? Are you just like matter eater lad now? Yeah, I hope so. You know, this whole little sewer area is sort of giving me flashbacks to, uh, inside. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What with the trying not to drown and being chased by murder dogs. Mm -hmm. it, it does seem, it does seem relevant. You're right. I'm having flashbacks to, uh, Eternal Sonata. I'm worried I'm not running to a rat. <laughs> a rat with a peach cookie? Yep. Who keeps giving these cookies to these rats? You think the door is north? Oh, oh, oh. oh god, oh. the dog's found you! The dog's found me. Quickly, oh, find a ledge! Dogs can't handle ledges! <laughs> or sloped inclines. <laughs> oh yeah, that's really dumb. Quick, get to a bathysphere! <laughs> oh, all of a sudden there's like a lot of dudes. There were no dudes, and now there are a lot of dudes. I don't think you're going to really get away from that. I didn't kill my wife! <laughs> I do not care! Yeah, this this lacks subtlety in terms of its overt reference. How many times has this been done in video games and movies? To, like, run to the end of a tunnel and then be yeah, like, Yeah, but, oh, like, this, this, this very specifically smacks of the fugitive, though. Yeah. <laughs> You know what I saw before The Fugitive, and actually had watched way more times than The Fugitive? What's that? U.S. Martian. Which is supposed to be the sequel to The Fugitive. I'm not sure if you're aware of this. I, I'm not aware of that. Yeah, this. you know, with uh, Wesley Snipes. I'm, I'm not Nobody really familiar with U.S. Martian. US Martian. Yeah, it's, it's Wesley Snipes. It's the same movie, actually. Yeah. Wesley Snipes. It's great. Yeah. Runs away. He's chased by a uh, mini Why does he suddenly have a special one? This is the bullet that... that that jammed in his gun before, uh, and so now he's like, "I'm gonna kill you with it because I got it. I've been keeping it this whole time for me to kill you with." This is where it ends. Now he's doing More it with the other finger hand. hands. Before he's doing it with this hand. Now he's doing it with this hand. Guess it doesn't end here. <gasps> Snake. Dun 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 dun. 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 Hope he's okay. I would not go in there. Oh, he landed directly on his eye. God. Ugh. Dude, he's that thing's gonna get infected. <laughs> like real bad. <laughs> Hashtag super water. Jeez. No, look, it was about to fire. Wait, don't. Why? Why won't he just load his gun properly? 
What is wrong with this asshole? That's a great question. What's funny is that, like, he didn't even start with revolvers. Snake was like, you should use revolvers. Right. And so it's, like, the whole, like, thing of, like, chance. Yeah. It's just, like, something he had developed. He's like, oh, revolvers are cool. Hey, look at this, like, well, fun, yeah, quirky, I mean, villainous no, thing I, I could I, do. I completely agree, because, like, I would buy it a lot more if that was just, like, part of his, like, weird character backstory. But yeah. the fact that they try and do this thing where, like, Snake made him this way, like, is kind of cool on one hand. But then, like, the rest of the character development in the game, like, makes no sense. Yeah. Apparently it's, uh, frame tearing here. Uh, I'm actually just pretty sure that he's tripping balls from all of the infection in his goddamn head right now. Like, literally in his head. Yep. Hey, Ghost Dad! Daddy! Are you one of the Cobras? What are you gonna do with that empty gun? Yeah, there's no bullets. Aww. Aww. I'm sorry. Oh, he needs a hug. Yeah, give him a hug, bro. What's wrong with him? Host of sorrows. That's right, Sorrow. You make it rain. Ouch. I am the sorrow. Like you, I too am filled with sadness. Really? Is it necessary to take off the hood if you're a ghost? And also if we don't, like, recognize you by seeing your face? Death brings sorrow. Okay. May not hear them. Their voices may fall upon deaf ears. But... No, I'm not deaf. I got one eye shot out. I just realized this is why that kid from uh, the Christmas story can't have a gun. Yeah, he will. I'm not sure why this guy is um, crying blood or whatever, though. Or why that broke his, like, glasses lens. Or why any of this is happening, really. So, if I remember this correctly, the solution to this part of the game is to take the fake death pill. Or to take the revival pill or something. But I think if you walk to the end of the river, you get something. That seems logical. I can sweep faster too. If you can, like, get it just right, then it seems like. I can't get past it. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to avoid all the, like, people that have killed. Oh, that's right. It, like,. Keeps track of like actual just like death yeah. count, right? Yeah, everyone that you've killed and how you've killed them. So like the dudes who's next to you slash they like spurt them like that. Right. What happens if you don't avoid them? Do they damage you? I think they do. I think they damage your oh, oh, But like so this is basically super easy if you manage to like she hunt it and just not kill anyone? Yeah. Also you have to dodge those because they just like still. What, like, it, it, like, remembers stuff that's on your memory card? Ooh. Oh, shit. Look out for demon. Oh, shit. By the way, demon. It's very strange. I like this idea. What? Jeez, that's weird. I like this idea in theory, but, like, it, it can't... It just feels like out of place in the game. They creep me the fuck out when I play. Oh yeah, no, this is super creepy. It. It like as like, a kid, just be really un unsettling. It seems like every time I play a Metal Gear Solid game, I end up playing the like the scariest part like late at night. Or <laughs> like when I like the very end of, of Metal Gear Solid Two, where there's like turn off the game. Yeah, everything's like I was no like, ah, what the fuck? So this creepy. Oh, there's that. Oh, it's the spider guy. Hey, spider guy. Bye, spider guy. You gonna, you gonna, you gonna weird Donnie Darko tentacle at me again? How much more walking in this water? <laughs> <game? laughs> it's this also is, weird. I'm pretty sure this is a lazy river. Yeah, it's a pretty lazy river. Yeah, that shit happens. I guess it doesn't really do. It anything. doesn't 
didn't seem to do it, like, much. took a little bit of my health Like, away. maybe? You already had some damage. I'm not even sure that I actually, like, hurt you. Yeah. I think, oh. I think right about now is when you're gonna start regretting that stealth technique you used in the I'm starting the to see some scientists. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, I don't under- like... The Sorrow isn't properly established as being, like, a real Cobra. So, like, why does he... Like, why is this happening? Spooky! Ooh, are we having a werewolf bar mitzvah? No, look, it's the end. Oh. I was like, what? Who has a parrot? <laughs> the end! Yeah. Didn't E.E. E. also have a parrot or something? She did, she had a parrot. E.E. E. Oh, did you see that dodge? Yeah, that was real close, though. Oh, I'll assume that was guy. for a dramatic effect, though. Oh, look, a vulture. Just eat that guy. Wait, why is that happening? Wait, what? That was one of those, uh... Flamethrower guys? Throw guys yeah. So, so that means we still haven't made it to... No, not yet. That's gonna- I'm really looking forward to that, because this is gonna be- like, you literally won't be able to touch. There's like so <laughs> many corpses, like... <laughs> Any minute now. It's weird to me that it, like, makes, like, no pretense of the fact you can't damage him. It's like, yes, he's a- oh. Yeah, so they, like, take your health away and touch them. But we're also on hard mode. Yeah, it's and very difficult. It's not doing that much damage. Oh, he's vanished. But it, it's like, oh, like, here's where his health bar would be if he was a for real bad guy, yeah. but he's not. What's that? I don't know what that is. Is that just a person? Ah! Oh. Whoa! Now you- now you dead. That was really abrupt, considering you had taken no damage. Yeah. I guess there's just a finite number of, like, spooks you can well, take? No, I'm not actually dead, but... Well, he did say it's time for you to get up. I guess that is the end? No, no, there's even? definitely an end that you could reach where he was, Gosh. like... You could see his corpse at the very end. I remember getting to it and walking for a while, just, like, running into it, trying to get somewhere for a little. You want to finish your mission, don't you? Then you'll have to shoot. Yeah. We're somehow getting a flashback of the sorrow. Yeah, right. Really. Don't be sad. <laughs> we'll meet again someday. Did they ever explain the circumstances of why that's the thing? Nope, that's all you get. Great. Also, you're definitely dead. <laughs> Yeah, props. Why does the water continue to look like tall? <laughs> Reasons. Duh. Hey, is there a version of that where you have to confront all the things you've eaten in the game? <laughs> But, like you're sitting in a toilet. It's kind of like No More Heroes, but like real graphic. <laughs> Man, I hope they make a new one of those. That would be great. I doubt that they will at this point. There is a sequel, right? I don't think I played it. Oh, he was there. Did he was there, yeah, I saw him. Um, speaking of games that they're making for systems, do you see they're coming out with Skyrim for the Switch? Gonna get it? I mean, I did Skyrim. hear that, but like they, Snake, they, I think right? they had already confirmed that. It was a close call. Um, the hell happened to me? You were halfway There's been a lot of funny of memes on Reddit. Most uh, crossed like, over to the other side. Come, like 2018, it's like Skyrim for really for your iPhone, and, and then like 2019, that? Skyrim Nature. for your microwave. <laughs> 2020, Skyrim for your rock. Yeah, I think I think my sister posted a Twitter this morning saying like, "Well, if I've learned anything from E3, it's that eventually Skyrim is just coming to everything with a computer chip in it." Yep. 
looking at ESP, which was a subject of extensive research um, in the Soviet Union. So, the one cool thing about Skyrim that's medium. announced? What? A medium. VR. Someone who oh, really? Communicate the whole with the goddamn world game. PSVR Skyrim. Are you words, getting that? Oh! They say that I would fucking buy. What's going on in a battle by talking to dead soldiers. Don't you want to fuck Skyrim boss? VR? What don't you want to puke in then? Skyrim? I don't know. I mean, details. you could puke on a dragon, Basco. I sort of want like oh. half of that. Don't you want to puke on a dragon? Not like the half that you want me to be excited about. You guys already knew that. Puking? Knew what? Yeah. Not so excited about that. Who's this guy? Years now. Died two years ago. At Selino Yards. You know those cliffs you were at. And the boss is the one who did him in. Ouch. Boss. Yep. Two years ago, the boss was sent by the CIA on a secret mission to Selino Yarsk. That's when she met the Sorrow, who'd gone back to the Soviet Union after the Cobras broke up at the end of the war. I don't know. I don't know where he came from. And then what? The boss. I'd love it if this was just the the major's voice for the rest of the game. Now he's just like a young black man. So, he was never there in the first place. He just couldn't let go of the boss. You okay, Snake? Yeah, I'm fine. It looks like it's not time for me to die yet. I sure oh, hope not. Otherwise, the whole mission is shot. We're counting on you, pal. Roger that. I really think they should have sent a poet. Because pretty much anyone other than Snake would have done a better job. I was worried. Are you all right? Yeah, I took a pretty freaky detour. What are you talking about? some serious balls. Yeah, get it. I was just saying I'm back. Good. And stay rotten fruit. I jumped in Stop the river. that! I also probably shouldn't have been eating that toad. You're out of control. Yeah, I got carried away by the current and almost drowned. Great, that's perfect. Have you seen the? Uh, mm -hmm. my, my mom sent me the the trailer for the the new Spider-Man game coming 2018. Let's meet up there. Uh, looks really good. Where is it? What does? That the new Spider-Man game? Oh yeah, yeah. I haven't watched the trailer yet. The waterfall, huh? Right. Behind that waterfall, there's a Does cave. it look like Spider-Man, we'll Spider-Man 2? The cave so. behind the waterfall it, upstream. It looks like... Got it. See you there. It looks like an extension from all of the, like, game design experimentation that went into Shattered Dimensions. Mm. Like, it looks like Shattered Dimensions plus plus. Because they've made some games since then that's sort of built on parts of Shattered Dimensions. <laughs> but, like, it feels like... They've just put a lot of work into fleshing it out and making it into like a full scale thing that looks really good. That's like cool. like Shadow Dimensions played really well, but like kinda still looked wonky. Like this sort of like looks like it's going to smooth out the rough edges and also make it look really cinematic in a way that no Spider-Man game really has pulled off. Cool. <laughs> Please get a good work. Please make it wobble. Can you make it wobble? That's a bummer, man. You just wobble, but they don't fall down. I can do nothing to the frog, apparently. I'm so sorry. I tried. I tried real hard. You to did. I, I feel like you should have at least been able to make it wobble. Wait. It's like, you're right there. The fork and everything. I know. Uh, I also heard from one of our Let's Watchers that... So, like, they had announced maybe a month ago, I think it was just a couple weeks ago, that, like, they are making uh, Life is Strange 2. Yes. Which is, like, the worst thing that humanity's ever conspired to create. Um... But then, if I'm understanding correctly, or if I was if it was reported correctly, uh, they are also releasing an interim prequel game, which is even worse than that. Because like as bad as a sequel would be, it would at least be able to incorporate the things that hypothetically make Life is Strange good. Right. Making a prequel means that it specifically happens before the events that make the first game, right. which basically involve getting superpowers, which are like the interesting part of that game. Right. So like, they, it's it's basically a prequel with a character who you basically don't properly meet in the original game, uh -huh. and then the worst character from the original game, and not having the part of that game that's any good at all. Cool. So that is coming out in August. Great. Perfect. That's what you wanted. It's, it's, it's the worst. It sounds absolutely dreadful. Can we just talk about what just happened? He shot at the ground until he gave up. He, like, saw you go under the tree, you never left, and he just gave up. Yep. That seems to be exactly what has happened. But there's also that guy. Save a kill spell for that guy. What's he doing? Lost the enemy. He must be hiding nearby. Thanks, Zephyr! 
He's doing us a yeah, solid. Yeah, it's definitely separate. Uh, perhaps we can sneak past these guards in the next one. Let's see you then. Look, if if Spider-Man Noir has a stealth mechanic that your game does not have, I feel like you fucked up. Why can't I fork underwater? Um, I don't know. They won't let you knife underwater either. For some reason, they just assume you're too slow. Too bad you're not, like, Breath of the Wild Link, because then you could just stand in the water and be like, FISH! COME INTO MY POCKETS! <laughs> I, I truly don't understand why that works that way. Uh, 